and welcome back to Until Dawn. Last where we left off, we had just finished rock climbing with Sam, and we met up with Mike. And I'm still a little confused and a little bit scared for Mike's fate, simply because in one of those totems, it showed Mike all beat up and all disfigured and demon-like. But I don't know, that may not be Mike, but let's go on and continue, but let me be quiet for the recap, like always. I got too excited, I have to admit. <laughs> Poor, poor man. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. No, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. It may have taken him down to the mine. Wait, don't move. Holy shit! I'm going to get that key right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm going to get us all the hell out of here. Holy shit! Hey! Whoa! Let's find a way down to where this fucker lives. You know, it is pretty weird how Mike looks more beat up than usual than before. I wonder, when are we ever going to play as Josh? Can you let me know, Dr. Hill, when are we going to play as Josh? Ooh, my back's at you. No. No. I wonder how much these sessions are of any help to you now. They're not helping me, I know that. I mean, I'm, I already fucked two people up already. It's pretty Fucked up. Oh, that's what I just said. I fucked up. What if Dr. Hill... Why is Dr. Hill not so scared about everything now? Gosh. There's time to learn. There's more to be afraid of. That can be dreamt up by the unhinged imagination of a self-indulgent, spoiled little brat! You had so many people who cared about you. I don't, I don't understand. I don't get it. Every turn you choose to push them away, and now you're all alone. So, these Dr. Hill sessions, the beginnings at least, were used to manipulate the game, but for the most part, they were used to basically psychoanalyze Josh and show us how deeply fucked up he is. Deep breath, Josh. Deep breath. Uh oh, are we controlling Josh? Oh, that's so creepy. Get away! Get away from me! No, you're dead! Sorry. You're dead! Shut up! Yeah, he's he's going crazy. You're dead! He's letting the death of his sisters just plague him. It's so hard. I'm not a coward. What is this? Is this is this is this him before he becomes that Mr. Robot guy from that TV show? He goes crazy and he realizes that the world is crazy and that all that fun stuff that computers are running in the world or something. I don't know. I don't know what that show's about. So I'm just talking out of my ass right now. I trust. We are playing as Josh. Ooh, this is a first. We have not. You have yet to play as him. I, I woke up what I recall. Oh hi, Beth. You're deaf. You're not real. You're all alone down there. Again. All alone. Oh my I god, now it's sad. Hannah and Buff. Family. Get away from me! Oh yeah, he's breaking. He is definitely breaking. Why didn't you save us, Josh? Why did you want us to die? I, he didn't. He was he was out cold, honestly. Is this gonna keep happening? Self-reflection time? Yeah, it's gonna keep on happening. I don't know what that is, but it's bulbous and it's pulsating. Oh. Is that me? Oh, that looks 
take the pig from um, Bloodborne. Ah! He punched it and it decapitated right away. Wow. Talk about Falcon Punch from Nintendo games. Oh, oh that's disgusting. I don't take orders. Okay, so he, I think he's basically imagining them. Is this what you want? Oh, Lord. Jesus. Why Have mercy. Are you doing this? So is he hearing them and they're manipulating him? Yeah, that, I think that has to be it. He's going crazy and they're manipulating his thought process. That's a wonder though. Uh oh. That has to be a wonder I I called it. So, I noticed something kind of weird about it. Um, what? No one to go. Ugh, excuse me. Scar. It had a scar? Where? What are you talking about? I saw these old pictures of some guys with that scar, and he was transforming into a Wendigo. Okay, yeah, yeah, so, because he was in the sanatorium for most of his gameplay, yeah, yeah, he knows. Which means that thing is 80 years old. At least. Spunky for an old timer. Uh, they killed a lot of people. They? You mean there are more of them? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he he knows and many. Too many. Not bad. You can't give a number. You can't get a definitive number for the Okay, we're gonna we're Sam now. How can you tell? I don't know, I just We're not going down again. We're not fucking up like that. Did I? I really don't want to go in there. There's no other way through. Is that what I think it is? Shit. Looks like a grave. Best watch. And it is a grave. But this is not the grave Hannah made. Oh, God. My kid. This is Beth. But Beth is dead. We already confirmed that. Let me see. Look. There was a cross here. So this is where she was buried. Wait. Where, there is, that was where the cross was, but where, where'd the cross go? And who dug her up, exactly? Let's keep moving. Yeah, I think we should. I hear I hear the little movements around the water and stuff. I hope Mike took that shotgun instead of ramming it to the door and put the shovel instead. Oh, a totem. Let's see what this totem has in store for us. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna be blowing up a house or some sort. They're gonna trap him in there. We gotta make sure nobody's in there. Mike, please do not get in my way. Fine. I'm going in. Oh, oh, oh no. What if they're in the water swimming? Oh. Come on, it's okay. It's pretty deep. Sure. I'm not dead yet. Famous last words. Famous last words, huh? Hit me with fingers. I wonder, is this the last chapter? Because we're one hour away until dawn. Wait a minute, I think uh, reached the deepest part. Well, I didn't say that. I said, it was okay. You didn't like there weren't any sharks or anything in here. Why would there be sharks in a cave, Mike? No, I don't, no, no, no. We're gonna keep on, I'm gonna keep on searching. No, no, that actually, that's actually where I have to go. I could tell they're not gonna put me in water for a couple of, for a couple of minutes just to kick me right back out. There's just a clue up there. That's why. Why? Why is she going that way? I'm not aiming my analog stick that way. Come on, there you go. I hope this isn't the way I have to go. In the notes because I could they're barely legible. I'm sorry, Beth. I have no choice. It's the only way I can survive anymore. 
someone finds this, I'm sorry. I had to. I had no choice. What does it mean? Jesus. Alright, we're gonna look at this. Alright. We missed a lot of clues, by the way. A bundle of papers that Hannah used as a journal. It tells of how she was trapped down the mine and starving. She took desperate action for which she felt profoundly guilty. Then her body began to change. The journal ends as incoherent scribbles. All right, let's read each journal entry. Day one. My little sister is dead. The fall killed her. I watched the color drain from her face. My leg is broken. I'm all alone, stuck here with Beth's body. Someone will come soon. Day five. I've never been so hungry. It feels like my stomach is twisting around inside. I took Beth's sweater. Much warmer now. She's still looking out for me. Day 30. I'm sorry, Beth. I have no choice. I'm dying. Wow, she went 30 days without eating before deciding to eat her sister. That's pretty sad, but at the same time, I understand. You have to understand, she's not going to eat her dead sister. You got to put yourself in a position. But yeah, anyway, it's the only way I can survive anymore. If someone finds this, I'm sorry. I had to. I had no choice. Forgive me, Beth. I'm sorry. Three days later, my hands feel unclean. My nails feel out, feel put out, pushed. My nails fell out, pushed out. I am aching, but no more cold. No, no more cold. No pain. I am getting stronger. Further writing devolves into scroll into scrolls. Oh, okay. Yeah, so we're watching her. I'm oh, telling you, she's a Wendigo. She's the Wendigo. She is the villain. Hannah. Dug up Beth. It was Hannah. Why would Hannah That's dig up Beth though? That's ridiculous. Michael, it has to be. The Why? Only thing that makes sense. Beth died in the fall. So what? What does that mean? So Hannah must have buried her. God damn it. God damn it. Hannah was down here. I don't believe any of it. She would have been starving. She would have been desperate. Fuck! We need to find Josh. Right now. I think Josh is, has been taken by our friendly neighborhood Wendigo. Because there is no hope for that, man. Now let's go back into the puddle of fun. The really big puddle of fun. Oh God! Hope all of your you guys' days are going well, though. You know, awesome morning I'm having. Pretty early in the morning right now. Oh, oh he's getting deeper. Yeah. Ah. Ah. Okay. 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 Oh. Ah. Hey, it's loading up again. We're gonna make it. We're gonna. You're saying we're gonna make it when we're right in front of it, and you're saying don't jinx it when we're right in front of it. Come on. Really, amazing choice of dialogue, guys. Nothing over there. Let's let's go into the fun door that says danger on it. You know. Oh, that's that is that's Buff's head. That is Jess's head. Jesus. And that must be Matt, the last one. That's Jess. That's Jess. That is Jess. I remember that face. That's Matt. Uh oh. Hey. Can they? How long can they breathe in the water, though? Yeah. Yeah, we're in Hannah's Hannah's territory. Oh. Oh my God. Don't let it get to you. Run. Stop it. We're gonna be sick. That's, I think we don't. We can't move now. Yep, this is Hannah. This is Hannah's den. Orders from you. Take orders from you. You can't. You can't tell me what to do. You can't Josh? tell me what to do Buddy. anymore. You can't. Yeah, he's his sister's death's really affecting him really badly. I feel so bad for him. Okay. I trust you. I trust you. I trust you. So what's going on? 
Very good movie. Josh, Hannah was down here for weeks, a month. She dug us up. Sam. Mike. Hey, let's just get the fuck out of here. Okay. Josh, do you have the key for the cable car? Uh, yeah. He actually does have the key. Oh, no, yeah, he does. He owns the, the place. Well, his parents do. See that over there? That means there's a direct way out. Come on. I don't know. I'm a little scared. Okay, if you help me up, I can go back to tell the others we're okay. Yeah. Yeah, good. You bring Josh back the way we came and we'll all get in the lodge. Be careful. Yeah, you too. Alright, let's go. You fucked up son of a bitch. I'm controlling Josh with Mike. That's a bit weird. Only be only weird because you didn't, you didn't have to hit me so much, man. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry about before, man. I I thought you killed Jess. What's this? I was wrong. Totem. All right, so Sam's gonna be confronted. We're gonna stay absolutely still and quiet. Thanks, Josh, for the warning. You're gonna live. I'll make sure of it. Unless you're meant to die. If you're meant to die, I'm sorry. He's limping too, yeah, he's in pain. From what though? No. No. You see? Oh. 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 Now he knows the repercussions of his little game that he played. I didn't want you to die. He's, yeah, I'm so sorry for him. Uh oh, we know who's in here. Some might ask why they don't mind walking in this water with shoes on and socks. I won't ask simply because, uh oh. Simply because they're in survival mode and why are we heading towards the Wendigo? Oh! Oh, you're not real! It's no, very you're real. Not. Hannah! It's Hannah. That, oh. 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 No! No! What, what is Mike doing? Why was his neck vibrating like that? Did you see that? I had to look at my computer screen again to see if I was confirming that correctly. Okay, let's pay attention. Uh, we're gonna climb. Jumping is cause risk. Triangle. Even though it has way more quick reactions, I have to do it this way. Because I have to avoid killing people. Um, we're gonna climb around. Triangle. Oh, it's getting faster. I need to be careful. There you go, you got it, Sam. I, I could have swore that's a uh, danger minority property. I'm gonna say racist. What's over here? Mr. Crow. What 
We're almost in dawn. Almost. We only have an hour or so left until dawn. Why is there why are there so many parts with water now? This is freezing cold water. Jesus Christ, she's gonna oh she's gonna well, she's gonna be shivering for a while. She's literally swimming. My face is inside the water. Oh, then we're moving faster. The screech means we move faster. It means we're gonna go fast. Come on. Really? I was there clicking X and it wouldn't highlight? Come on. Alright, you're dry. You're good, you're good. Blah, blah, blah. Come on. Let's get moving. God, there's a little bit of snow there to cushion her fall a little bit. Oh, God. Where are we now? Is this the lodge? The shed? Run. Happy that she's running. Thank you. Triangle. I've always wondered why Sony has made shapes for their button. There you go. You use your athleticism. Sir Paul. Good. Hey! Hey! Oh, come on, open up! Guys, come on, are you in there? Let me in! Damn. What is... What's wrong with him? It's gonna look worse if we stay out here. Come on. How do you get there so fast? I feel like he was the one screeching. Good. They can't. They can't see light. They they see Check movement. Might be someone left down there. Might be someone left down there. What do you mean? We're just looking for our friends. Ah, that's pretty cool. He's a little cold, but I'm still a little skeptical about Mike right now. Uh oh. Oh, it's very dusty and dirty in there. Holy hell. I don't know hell could be holy, but holy hell, hell, holy, holy, blah, 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 blah. This is a survival. Hmm? I'm trying not to think about it. Go, go, go! Oh. Oh my God! What? This bitch. I wasn't gonna lock it. There was no point. They can break down 75 pounds of... 750 pounds of shit. Yeah. Oh, don't move. Don't move. Don't fucking move. I'm not gonna move, Mike. Is that Hannah? Oh, Lord, have mercy on my soul. Oh, they know that's the squad. Squad pulled up. Squad? Squad? Squad, squad, squad? 
Uh-oh, uh-oh. Is it a Pokemon battle? Uh-oh. Well, Lord have mercy. I don't know how they're... A gas leakage. We're gonna have to utilize that. Oh, Mike is thinking aggressively right now. Oh, no. You got this, Sam, and Mike, and Ashley, and Chris. Why'd that go in slow motion? Is, is Hannah fucking them up? Is that Hannah? Oh shit, this is so scary. Where is its vagina or penis? Ah. I see what he's doing. Well, Chris booked it. We're saving Mike. Hey! Hi, Emily. Get out. Oh my god. Oh, it has panties on. That's, yep, that's Hannah. No one over can't see the vagina. Very nice panties, I think. Up, oh, I moved. Oh, fuck. I moved? Are you serious? I can't believe that happened. No, I didn't move. No! Well, fuck. Shit happens, I guess. Ah. Is there a way to reverse that? What's my status update? I guess. We have visual. The main structure is completely destroyed. Over. <laughs> is this the end of the game? I have confirmation on four survivors. Let's pick them up. We could have had Sam survive. I had five survivors, but I made I made the mistake of moving. I don't know how I moved, but I didn't move. I stood still. Okay, let's watch this. Let's watch the credits. They were both dead. They, I killed them both, obviously, as you saw. Oh. Where's Jess? Show me Jess's death. No! Could have saved her if I would have been risky. Could have saved her if I didn't move. Uh, the old man, I, uh, I, I don't so people are getting interviewed at the end now? You said you thought he was stalking you at first. Did anyone else in your group think that? Well, yeah. <laughs> Is it possible they could have killed him? No. What? No. No, you, you, you don't understand. Don't you understand? And if he attacked you. He saved my life. Are they trying to put the blame on the stranger? And I watched him die. He got decapitated, Jesus Christ. I heard Jessica. I don't know how or why she was down there, but I know I heard her. She was dead. He held it right up to my face. Right here, right in front of my nose, and he could have shot me. He almost shot me, the prick. What a bitch. You go out with a guy for however long, and you think you know him, but man, this one really takes the cake. Well, fuck you. He's out of his fucking mind. He wanted to hurt us. Okay? And... Oh, oh, 
Jaws. Attack Jess. At least he says he thought he was the one who attacked Jaws. I stabbed him and I tried to get away, but I didn't know. I swear I didn't know. Didn't know? Who did you stab? Oh, I, I, I stabbed the maniac. I didn't know it was Josh, but then he was the psycho. And how was I supposed to know Josh had all the sauce and the gun and all? No, you're okay. You're justified. About Matt, have uh, have you found him? No, not yet. Matt's dead. Yeah, well, don't look too hard. You don't sound very concerned. Fucker left me to die. He said he was my boyfriend, but then he basically murdered me. Would you give a shit? Well, fuck. You know what, honestly? You know what? Let me wait till they're done so I can give my, my, my opinion. So close, man. If I had just been... A little faster. I just... I could have saved her. I could have saved her. So it's my fault. And the reason Jess is dead. Josh helped us. And then... Fuck, man. <laughs> that thing... Okay, the Wendigo, it came out of the darkness and it just, I don't know. I heard screaming, I got out of there. There was no point in both of us dying. He wasn't screaming, he, you just saw him get taken. I'm not skipping this, we're watching them, unless it's just, just content now. Yeah, I'm gonna skip that. Okay. Uh oh, let's see what's here. Let's see it. Josh became a one to go. Okay. So, before we end the video here, I'm going to give my little opinion on every character. Let me let's look at the status and collectibles so I can see every character. Am I able to see every character? Didn't find every totem either. I am not able to see every character, but I could from here I could say bonus content actually. Nope, 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 not meet the cast. Nope, we're not trying to watch videos here. Oh, wow. They, they really did motion capture here. Wow. Fantastic. Whatever, let's stay in the main menu. So, for Chris and Ashley, they're perfectly fine to me. They, they're, they're normal people. They react normally. They're a very perfectly fine couple for me. They reacted in ways that they should have reacted, and I controlled them in ways that I felt as if they would react in real life. All right, done. Mike, Mike is a little, Mike is a little, a little. He he tells a little bit of white lies here and there, but he's a genuine good person. Like in his heart, he means well. Just I didn't get to experience most of Just, other than the fact that she felt very uncomfortable because of Emily and how Emily belittled her all the time. But if we would have had to have had just survive a little longer, we would have probably she would have probably been a little bit more a little bit more exaggerative than Ashley, but a little bit more confident because she wasn't too hesitant with you know attacking verbally whatever it is that was outside. Um, Emily don't like her at all. Just a uh, conniving bitch. She the way she reacted, that was very selfish. Her thinking that Matt left her to die and how she was not concerned. She was probably only with. Matt to make Mike jealous and that's not cool. Matt, I really like Matt. Matt was a sweetheart. He did his best um, from the character choices that not only did I give him but the character choices that I had to choose from in general. He was very concerned not just for not for him but for Emily first before himself and it sucks that he had to die the way he did because of one little mistake that I made. Same thing with Just but whatever. Sam, Sam was one of my favorite characters but at the same time we didn't get to experience much of Sam. 
We played a little bit with Sam, and then that's it. A little bit of rock climbing with her, which was very anticlimactical with Sam. Um, I'm kind of sad that she had to die in the end because I, I swore to God I did not move. But whatever, I, I, I'll just leave it at that. And Josh, I didn't expect him to be the psycho. I expected him to be behind ha some of the stuff in the house, but I didn't expect him to be the actual psycho. But he was pretty cool. I liked the way he was just going crazy at the end, but I, I'm still wondering just as... Just for personal gain, or just just to know, I'm wondering why why Hannah kept him alive each time. Was it revenge? Was it a Wendigo revenge, which is the curse? Was it the curse? Um, or whatever. Um, I I kind of understood why he was going crazy. Uh, really enjoyed Doctor Hill's character. He was really cool. And the stranger, we didn't see enough of him. I don't. He felt he felt forced. But aside from that, I really like this game. I'm not going to give it a number rating because I don't believe in number ratings like, you know, journal, like those journalistic or um, video game articles give numbers, but I really enjoyed the game. Felt like it had its flaws. I was kind of I was kind of um weirded out at the fact that it, it went from from um uh it went from a psychological slasher horror game to a, a supernatural um survival game. A little weird for me. Um not enough jump scares throughout the game for me to be able to fe actually feel scared like the game was scary yes but not scary scary where i was on my seat ready to jump like i kind of expected half the jump scares especially considering that the beginning of the game i kind of figured out that dr hill was controlling the scares within the game um and i figured that out once i saw the spider and the the, the clown in the forest kind of stuff and that's another thing I kind of I kind of have um, one little issue with the game before I finish up the video here um, is that a lot of the jump scares happened in the beginning, not towards the end. The end just from the middle on it just went from scary to just survival, running, and story basically. And I I mean they could have put on a little bit more jump scares just to have me just to have me at least as a player jump a little bit more. But whatever, I enjoyed the game. Really awesome game. Really happy that I finally got to play it and finish it but on that note i'm gonna leave you guys here um leave a like comment and or subscribe if you haven't let me know what you thought of the game and have a good day later guys